Uh, okay, friends. Uh, I would like to tell a story about uh, the legend of Batu Meras. Once upon a time, lived an old widow with her beautiful daughter named Darmi. They lived in simple house that located at the end of the village. Since Darmi's father died, their lives became difficult. His father did not leave any inheritance even a little to them. Her mother works on the other people's feel as laborer. This morning, her mother getting ready to go to work in the field owned by others as laborer. While Dami still Her mother continues to work, although her tired, she keeps working. But you look so tired. No, 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 no. You took a rest. For your salary, I will bring it for you, ma'am. Mm. Thank you, ma'am. Darmi is beautifying herself on front of the mirror. Her mother coming home. I really beat you. No one as beautiful as I am. Assalamualaikum. Mom, where have you been? Why are you back home so early? I was walking. Tell me. If someone said Assalamualaikum, you have to answer. 
Come on. You don't need lecture like to me. You just work, right? No. Where is money for me? Money? For what, Darmi? You are so chatty. Don't ask something that isn't important. I want to buy some lipstick because my lipstick is almost wear up. But we need this money for our daily life. This is important. If I don't have lipstick, I will not play it again. Thank you. Just use half of it. I take all. If you really need this, you can work again. As usual, Darmi walking around the village without a clear direction and purpose, only the sound of her beauty. Lots of villagers saw the behavior of Darmi, including young boys. One of them was Belly, who was greatly amazed to saw her far away. Darmi, would you come with me to work in the fields? What? I think something wrong with my ears. You want me to go to where you working in the fields? You. That's right, Darmi. I want to take you with me. So, you can help me and my will become more easy. Mom, I'm pretty young, so I don't deserve to work in the fields. Moreover, the fields were muddy. I don't want the, my smooth skin and beautiful nails become dirty. What people think if they are not about this? But you have to help me. After you already passed away, I will learn for both of us. I'm tired. That's your problem and your responsibility. You really deserve to roll in the fields. Muddy, dirty. You are too old, wrinkled. There are no men wanted you anymore. Just not like me. That's too much, Darmi. <laughs> Whatever. Now, if you wanna go, just go. You waste my time for nothing. Meanwhile, Belly is talking with her mother in the field, talking about Darmi. Yes, mother. I really love her. So who is she? You will know, mother. Soon. I promise. Well, let's go together. You have to say if you love her. Yes, mother. You have to hurry, son. I do. Well then, let's go. Okay, let's go. At this time, Darmi walking trails not necessarily, only just to show her beauty. Do you know is? There will be festival out the village. Oh yeah? Yeah. What's festival? I didn't know that. We should come. 
one. Hi, Darmi. Darmi, day by day, you look more pretty. Of course. Everyone knew it. You're right, Darmi. We know that you are the most beautiful girl here. Huh? Now you say. What are you up to, by the way? Huh? None of your business. Hey! What is this? Who are you? I... I love you. What? You love me? Did you realize what you said? Do, do you wanna marry me? What? Hey! Who do you think you are? You are poor man. You don't deserve me. You are dirty. Do you think that I'm similar for you? Only rich men can get me. Not like you. On the way home, that day, I was on the way to home. She broke expenditure, but because of weak condition and the intenses of sunlight, she was filled to fainted. For good sake, Benny came to help. Sure that you're really okay. Yes, thank you for being so kind. I have to go now. Oh uh, yeah, I'm I'm not from here. The old lady, uh, she was tired. I, I just tried to help. Wow, you are kind. Thank you. Um, oh yeah, I'm in. That mean, ah, uh, so I have to go. Darmi's mother cleaned the house. Suddenly, Darmi asked for money for something useless.
say assalamualaikum. Ah, uh, whatever. Where is my money for today? Give it to me now. For oh, what, Daphne? Don't ask too much. Just give me the damn money right now. I don't have money. I already used it. I put you to work with me. You just spend money for nothing. Ah, uh, give your money to me. Give it back! Give it back! This is mine! Give it back! Remember, you don't try to this again. You must bring your my salary every day. If you don't so, I don't give me a damn. But to hurt you. My lord, forgive me that sins. Forgive me. I can raise her to be good girl. Please forgive me. Ma, are you alright? Come on. What's that? Why did she treat you like this? That is my daughter. Her name is Daddy. I was wrong. It's my fault. He asked me for money. But. I could not. Anyway, why you here? I brought you this. This is yours, right? Thank you, sir. You are kind. Please come in. I'll make you a cup of tea. Desti and Mutiara talk about us. Ma'am, I feel sorry about you. You always work so hard. What are your daughter, ma'am? Doesn't she want to help you? I'm sure if she helps you. You don't have to work so hard. I think she want to help me. Maybe she have something to do now. Oh, well then. Well, let's ask some tax salary. Oh yeah? Yes, and I hear today we go home early. Oh, let's go. Let's go, ma'am. You go first. No, let's no, no, no. ma'am. On that time, as usually, Darmi will refit herself. Her mother will just back home immediately need to end to the market. Oh shit! I don't know my makeup. It will be disaster. Mom! Where are you up to? I want to go to the market. Just in time. Can you buy some makeup and lipstick for me? I can live without all of my makeup. And never buy the other brand. Then I often use. I don't know about it. Why don't you just come with me? Uh, I never wanted to go anywhere with you. But I don't know the brand that you use. I can't even read. What happened if I wrong? You want to use it, right? Okay, okay. I'm going with you. But, other condition, you must walk behind me and you cover your head with scarf. Why? You will embarrassing me if you walk side by side with me. Why if you have to embrace again me? Aren't me is your mother. That's why I told you to see yourself in the mirror. You are all, you are cause all dirty. You just like bummer. I really embarrass her mother like you. I even can't stand beside you. Come on. On the street, just like Darmi said before, her mother didn't walk side by side with her. 
She and her mother were spacious lady Florence. Her mother wore dirty clothes. Dendarmi wore nice clothes. As though they are not family, however. Then Dendarmi met her some friends. Hi Dendarmi, where are you going? Of course, it's not. It's my new maid. Hi, Darmi. Why are you so hurry? I want to go to market. Who is she? My assistant. I'm sorry, she left your mother. Are you blind? How can she is my mom? She is dirty. Don't you see that? Oh, you're right, Darmi. Darmi, why did you say that I'm your mate? I'm your mother. Mom! What the hell are you doing? Why are you stand close to me? Nami, so are you mean? Just stay from me.
story of legend and mathematics. Thank you. Sudah ya, Bang? Hmm. Hah? Iya, sudah. 